So in a previous example, we looked at creating sheets and we touched on title blocks, but let's just look at the creation of these. So I'm going to add a rectangle at zero, zero as my start point. And then we're going to make this eight and a half by 11. So there is my title block, or there is my outside border. What I'm going to do is go ahead and make that a string and then do an offset of that at a quarter of an inch inside. So we want this to go to uh, eight by 1.5. And then we'll add a few more pieces of information to this. For example, I'll add some text. And we'll position this where we want. We can adjust the settings for that or keep it as it is for my notes. I'll also add keywords. So a couple of keywords I'll enter is the scale. So we're going to put the scale down here in the middle. Uh, Let's make a couple of changes to this. Let's make it bottom center justification. Let's change the color. Scales in, I'll add an additional keyword for the date. And then one more for the sheet number. Okay, so we'll add those in. And then we will make these part of our library. So we're going to do ANSI A, this is portrait. The offsets on this were 0 0.25, 0 0.25, 0 0.25. So that's my margin setting. We'll insert in the lower corner and then we'll define the drawing area. I'll give that a name and save it. Now what happens when I come into one of my drawings and I go to create sheets, I can pick that title block. Okay, we're going to make this a 30 scale. And we'll adjust the orientation. And I'm going to tell it that I need two of these across. Oh, let's bring that right about there. And we'll put a little bit of overlap on it. So let's go ahead and make that three sheets. There we go. We say, OK, I'll do each one as its own separate drawing, its own separate sheet. And activate all three of those so I can see them. And now those are in. There's my scale, the sheet number. And the date, which will show when I go to the print preview, there's my date. For more details on creating title blocks, creating sheets, plotting, saving these as PDF, please review the content on my TopCon now. For more information on creating sheets, creating title blocks, or other topics, please log into your MyTopCon Now account and look at the amazing content that's available to Magnet users today.